hello my beauties welcome back to my channel so today's video is a lemon challenge I've seen so many videos on lemon challenge on YouTube but today I'll be doing my own version of a lemon challenge as you can see I'm holding two lemons in my hands lemony stick it in my hands so I'll be using these two lemons to do my challenge today if you're new to my channel welcome and please don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell and leave me a comment in the comment section down below of what you think of the video today or what you think about my channel in general and to all my subscribers thank you guys so much for watching my videos and for sticking with me all right guys let's jump right in so another thing is this is my first voiceover video yeah I'm so excited. Um, I can't wait to see how it goes. All right, come on in. All right, guys, so we are inside now, and here on a plate, I have three cloves of garlic, a decent size of ginger, you can use as much as you're comfortable with, one teaspoon of ground cinnamon, one tablespoon of organic honey, two regular sized lemons, two quarter cups of warm water, one orange or lime squeezer, a pot, and a measuring cup. So guys, the reason why I chose to add extra ingredients to this challenge is because I like doing things um, my own way differently from what everybody else is doing. Um, I mean, everybody else, everybody is unique in their own way and I just don't want to do this challenge based off of it's a challenge, let me do it the way everybody is doing it. I want to gain something from this challenge and I don't want to cause more harm to myself so i will not be eating my lemon raw today just for you to know that i'll be adding um everything that i've showed you the minced garlic that I've, i'm showing you right now the chopped up um, ginger the cut up lemons i will squeeze those lemons i'll squeeze their juice because i'm gonna be needing their juice for my challenge so when you look at the lemon it's quite seedy but it's okay i'm only um, I only need the juice anyways. I don't need um, the seeds. So I'll be squeezing the juice with my squeezer um, later on in the video. So um, I went online to check about lemon and study shows that it's better to mix lemon with um, other foods or liquids. It's not safe to drink lemon unfiltered or to drink raw lemon juice it's quite unsafe right and what you're looking at right now is my water that i will be using to boil the garlic and ginger so that's a measuring cup on the side i measured out two quarter cups of warm water and i added it to my cup my favorite cup so that's the measuring cup that i used so i added two quarter cups into my cup so and there's a pot uh, i will show you that um, that one later a little bit in a few moments so i will add that warm water to the pot and i will add the garlic um, i'm just showing you the measuring um the measurements on the body of the cup okay so that we are clear if you don't have a measuring cup yeah i don't know but it would be better if you have a measuring cup so yeah and um did i lose track of what i'm saying no okay so that's my warm water okay that i got from that measuring cup okay fine all right so now um i'm gonna be adding my ginger and my garlic in a pot um that's the rest of the tools and the ingredient that's the honey okay so i'll be adding it in the pot right here okay and then i'll pour my water okay into the pot right okay so i'll pour my water into the pot and then i will add my ginger and garlic and I'll boil that for five to ten minutes all right to get the juice out so garlic is quite medicinal another thing is watch be careful be cautious of lemon juice lemon juice 
as its benefit don't get me wrong it's rich in vitamin c and vitamin c gives uh, a boost to your immune system while also helping to produce collagen collagen is needed to keep your skin your tendons your cartilage your ligaments and blood vessels healthy that's my squeezer that i will use in squeezing the lemon the juice out of the lemon so um there's also side effects for drinking lemon juice raw which i will not be doing today it could cause um ulcers and it could cause enamel tooth enamel decay i'm squeezing my lemon juice right now it could cause your tooth to decay and to avoid the risk of enamel decay from lemon juice do not drink the juice unfiltered mix it with other liquids please um garlic you should not use garlic if you're allergic to it now because garlic is not proven to be safe for nursing moms um i i boiled the garlic and ginger longer for about 10 minutes to uh, um, 12 minutes because you know so just to have some benefit and be safe some benefits of garlic is that it boosts the immune system if you're the type that gets sick a lot including um, common cold or flu you should add more garlic to your diet just so you know there's also side effects of um, garlic um, okay I've I've finished um, squeezing out the juice so now I'll pour it back in that measuring cup that I have and from what I got from those two regular size lemon what the juice I got after squeezing it is just about a quarter so guys I'm gonna add all our liquids together in the end and mix them with the honey and the ground cinnamon all the ingredients are very beneficial if used properly all right my beauties so i noticed that the cup i have before will not be able to contain everything so i changed the cup so that's the ground cinnamon that you're looking at right there and the honey and the lemon and the ginger and garlic water that i boiled so i mixed everything up now i'm going to drink it so let's count down for balance so three two one go hmm tastes yummy <laughs> i love it so guys that's it if you like this video or if you're going to be trying my own version of the lemon challenge please don't forget to leave me a comment in the comment section down below and let me know what you think let me know if I did a good job I mean everybody is unique in their own way so this is my own version of the lemon challenge and I like it I'm comfortable with it so thank you guys so much for watching I'll see you guys next time and remember keep your feet steady pace yourself and let your faith always be bigger than your fear